Yeah, just took off on day three in the morning, uh, five o'clock um, startup, and uh, just pack everything on the vehicle and went for an hour drive uh, through those um, those canyon and valley, fully off road, like crossing those dry riverbed to move along um, on a, onto a quarry, a really old quarry where we arrived like maybe around seven thirty, and uh, just pretty dodgy place. You could see like a big um, big tunnel going from one side to the other of the mountain. There was like a crazy garden just over there that was holding the, the place up. We've basically driven up a mountain. This is not like driving to the trailhead at home. This is not uh, Afan car park. And we're basically going to do the last thousand meters on foot with our bikes. And we're just going to try and see how far we can get. We've got some straps, so if we need to lift bikes over bluffs, that's what we're doing. We started working our way up and uh, we'd take the old break here and there. We lost some of the group where it was so cold and stuff and they had to sort of um, just wait for us to do the final part. And we carried on trucking up this really cambered hillside um, full of crazy rocks and yeah I gotta say I was pretty nervous when it came to the whole um, idea of riding back down um, because I guess if it went wrong it would go pretty badly wrong. We get up there the wind is it's got to be close to 100 miles an hour and you're just able to lean into it and just fly it feels like and it was just craziness the energy up there even though your hands are super cold your face is getting wind burned. Um, we hung up hung out out there and had a little snack hidden behind some rocks for a bit and uh, then we started riding down and riding down you realize really quick that uh, it could get ugly fast there's no trail it's loose made me feel like I just didn't even know how to ride a bike um, even worse following fab down made it look kind of easy uh, and so you get going and all of a sudden you hit a tuff of grass and you're like, oh God, you know, like you, everything you can do not to go over the bars because there's just like shark fin rocks sticking out of the ground like that tall, just wedges that if you, it would just take your arm off, you know, I mean, just some pretty sketchy stuff, but super fun at the same time. There's no trails, it's the side of a mountain. <laughs> up down at the bottom and the guy who we'd seen but as we were driving up the road kind of 20 kilometers before the guy kind of walking up the road on a donkey we find him in the car park and it turns out he's the security guard and he's got a little hut up there and he's making them um, he's making Ali the driver and Susie um, cups of tea Susie from Mojo and he's kind of looking after her like um, like long lost sister and it's fucking great you know sat in this little tent with a, a door beaten out of an oil drum uh, sort of peeled off and beaten straight and just hung on a couple of bits of wire and he's got a little blanket on a piece of wood inside as his, um, as his seat it's just got a piece of plastic on the roof to stop the rain coming through the mud roof and um, he's got his little caligas stove in there and he, he's given uh, Susie and Tom from Mojo, little lessons on how to make mint tea. So, you know, it's just an amazing little moment. Just incredible. See how this guy lives with his dog on the mountain. <laughs> the ride down was way better than we kind of thought it was going to be. Yeah. Real loose. Yeah, real loose. And anything you do with Bobbing is pretty stupid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can do it. 
<laughs> right? It's fun. Well, you've done it, Amel. No. I'm yeah, you, you, it. you've done it. Yeah. <laughs> so. yeah, we all survived. That's the main thing. <laughs> Just ride down and try to hike up in that red line and make sure that we hit that Cody trail. Definitely not in Kansas, as we've said once before. It's uh, it's different, to say the least. It smells different, the looks different. We're acting different. <laughs> but uh, hey, we're still smiling. <laughs> Get high get down. Get high. Get high. Oh, oh Salvucci, a front and a back. Lucky. You did a front and a back. So I've seen. But I went I did. Dude, you gotta be pretty high, Panama Red. Oh. oh. How do you feel about that pouring device? Uh, pretty shit, I would say. <laughs> that, that wasn't the quality of the WC. Third Look at that. Working. Yeah, you want me getting on the Oh, 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 oh,